Alright, good morning. I'm just giving you an update. We're looking at Bitcoin here and I'm going to give you two different scenarios of what I'm looking at. I'm looking for us to break down all the way to 2800 and under, maybe as low as the 2000 range. Ooh, scary. Um, that is one scenario that we can be setting up for here and it could be pretty um, huge of a, a move. Uh, there would probably have to be some catalyst for this, but it is a possibility and we have to keep it in mind so that what you see right there from 2800 and under um, is what I'm looking at as one scenario and then we have the other scenario if we stay on the inside and we retrace maybe 61.8 to 88 but we basically stay within the the boundaries of it and you can see that right there then that would give us an upward target all the way back to 4,800 to the 5,000, the low 5,000 range. Um, that is also a scenario. Now, which one am I choosing or, or expecting to occur? Answer is simple. Neither. I'm expecting um, the market to tell me to allow itself to work itself out and to tell me which way it's going to go. And uh, so right now I'm just keeping my powder dry and um, that's basically it. There's nothing to do until we get a breakout upwards, of which I'd be a seller, or a breakout downwards, of which I would be a buyer. So that's an update. Those are the two patterns. One inside consolidation, upward to uh, above the 4,800 to 5,000 area. The other one, downward consolidation, uh, back to the 4,000 uh, range, the low 4,000 range, uh, if that occurs. So that's what I'm looking at. And other than that, have a great week, and we'll go on from there.